first tonight, the death of the little girl injured in Kalgoorlie while in state care. The major crime squad is now investigating the case as a suspicious death, but detectives still don't know how she came to be so badly injured. Amelia Bruin reports. The 20-month-old girl was in state care with relatives in Kalgoorlie when she received the horrific head injuries last Friday. She was flown to Princess Margaret Hospital and spent the past week on life support. But last night, the little girl died of organ failure. We have a little 20-month-old who's now in heaven and I want to get to the bottom of what Will happened to her. The major crime squad is continuing its investigations into what took place in the two hours between between a caseworker seeing the toddler and when she was taken to hospital. But police say they are still no closer to knowing how she came to receive such critical injuries. We're still looking for information so that anybody out there who might have information about this or can help with this inquiry at all, we would welcome that. The death will also be the subject of independent inquiries by the coroner's office and the ombudsman. The opposition claims there's been an alarming increase in the number of child protection cases in Kalgoorlie, with numbers quadrupling in the past two years. But it says there's been no additional staff assigned to help cope in the last two state budgets. It is of concern to me that the numbers are going in the wrong direction uh, in terms of the number of foster carers who are available um, to provide safe placements. I'm satisfied that we have been putting in the resources and the policies in this term of, of government. Amelia Bruin, 10 News.